it's time to raid Labyrinthos on Let's Play Xenosaga Episode 3. Also, Spa Sadathustra. Well, viewers, it is time to raid Labyrinthos. Are you ready? Well, I hope you are. For some odd reason, the Professor and Scott are with us. I don't know why they're with us. I guess, well, we are going there to steal the vessels of Anima, so that might be why. Now, here's the thing. I hope you guys, um, did what I did before and went and get the, um, Decoder 15 from Mai at the, um, the right mine. Might want to do that before you head here. Just a little pro tip. Hmm? What are civilians doing here? They're currently storing power reactors for a new type of energy, um, Emini, uh, Emini. <laughs> for a new type of enemy. Oh my god, fail. Epic fail. I'm leaving that in. Oh god, where is it? Here it is. Hashtag Kofefe, by the way. Oh yeah, I need some Kofefe after this shit. There. We can get into Labyrinthos from that gate. Yeah, but we have no ID. There are guards. Well, we'll just have to murder them. <laughs> we have IDs, so no problem, right? Uh, actually, we can't go any further with these IDs. Yeah. If there's no other route, then we have no choice but to go in by force. Yeah, I'm not being stuck in this era. I don't belong in this era. So if somebody has to die so I can get out of this era, then they're just going to have to die. Yeah, we're going to have to fight sooner or later. Let's get it over with. Yeah, let me shove a bullet up their ass. I'm off for that. Let's go! Because it's battle time, bitches. Don't underestimate me. And we got a new enemy here. Let's see. Domo... Uh... Th the fuck is that, um, symbol? Domo something. <laughs> Domo! Well, I, I I don't have his data on me. But suffice it to say, he is a, um... You know, a machine, so lightning that... Oh, yes! No! Oh! I equipped everyone with the yellow rings, you know, because we were going into an in uh, area that has, you know, mechanical enemies! Bow! Nice. Break that! <laughs> yeah. Break yourself, bitch! Bow! Overkill! Ow! Oh, you How dare you? Huh. Fuck you think you are. Ha! And oh yeah, we got Cosmos back. Woohoo! Full throttle that bitch! Junior looks so... <laughs> Seeing him, um, take down a machine like that in his swim trunks is just fucking... Is, is insane. Well, fighting in your swimsuits in a guard facility is kind of insane to begin with, but, you know. Alright, we can now proceed. To Labyrinth, those bitches! Hmm. I, I seriously doubt we're going to have the same experience we had with Labyrinth, those in the second game. A. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. Oh. <laughs> Well, we got the annoying announcer lady, so... Oh, it's those guys from the second game! Yeah, those PSS dudes! The one I had to use a whole bunch of stock commands to take down? Oh, fuck these dudes, man. I'm gonna enjoy kicking your ass. You better run. <laughs> you better run. Yeah, I'm literally facing Xenosaga 2 enemies right now. And in any case, there are new enemies in this game's context. P PSSP. Uh, 520 HP, they're weak to ice and lightning. PSSB is um, 450 HP, they're weak to... Um, actually, they have no weakness, but they're strong against lightning. And of course, the other guy, 078 Grizzly 2. 900 HP, mechanical, weak to lightning. So, there you go. Needless to say, Woohoo! Junior, you're having a field day with that rodeo spike, bitch. Yeah. Take him out! Break yourself! Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> okay. You dare hit a girl? How dare you! And guess what? Your ass just got manhandled by a girl. 
So, there you go. Break yourself! Ow! <laughs> Didn't mean to shoot a guy with a down, but, you know, I had the opportunity, so... Ha! Nice. Oh! Okay! So I... Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's fine! I did that to your comrade, so it's only fair. Break yourself! <laughs> oh man. We have fun here at Labyrinth. Oh wait. I don't care, lady. Damn. You think that we care, but we don't. So okay, okay, we gotta go to the west first. Is this open? Oh, it actually is open. Huh, what? Is there a problem here? Hmm. I didn't... This place was supposed to be heavily guarded. I'm kind of shocked that they're on security alert. Hmm. Well, whatever. Oh, now it's locked. Okay, fuck you, game. Making me come all the way in here. <sighs> whatever, just... Just forget it. Security level has been switched to A. All access... <laughs> There you go. I'll take that mid cadets off your hands. Needless to say, that route's cut off too, so we gotta make our way back to the east. Good boy, man. Well, viewers, enjoy our trip down Zeno Saga 2 Lane. Because the last time we're dealing with this bitch! Get in my way and you'll pay for it! Oh, this bastard! <laughs> PSSA, 700 HP, weak to ice and lightning. This dude is by far the most annoying asshole random encounter in the second game. Of course, it's the third, so things are different. I'm much more powerful! Ow! So, I have no problem slicing and dicing some bitches! Like that. So, yeah. Now! Ernie Kaiser! Go, go, Power Rangers! Break yourself! There you go. Get it? Because they just broke. Ha! Goodbye! And now for you, my bitch. Ha! Break yourself! They can't. They're dead. How can they try again in 10 years if they are dead, Junior? They'll never get the opportunity. Ha! Hello! Here we go! Oh, now facing four of these bitches? Wow. Okay. Well, I knew this was gonna happen sooner or later. <laughs> nice. Alright, I need some Ernie Kaiser up in this bitch. Because, you know, I just can't. Ernie Kaiser! Forward! Go, go, Power Rangers! Oh! <laughs> Fuck yes. Hey, dude! Break yourself! <laughs> oh, you get it too, bitch! Suck on my bullets! There you go. All systems functioning normal. God, it's so good to have Cosmos back. She just... She's our guardian spirit, honestly. She just... She doesn't say much. But she just gets shit done none, nonetheless. That's why she's awesome. Ah! Alright, viewers of Mac, I took out that guy. And over here, you gotta destroy some objects over here. But you can find... Security segment level. address 15. And what do you know? We got the decoder for it. Noise. That's why I mentioned going back to um to Mai and getting the decoder. So if you do, you can get the Hano Kagora, or however the fuck you pronounce it. I don't know. But in any case, this weapon will make Jin very powerful right now. Probably one of his best weapons, at least for this point in the game. Just beautiful. Beautiful. Look at it. Look at that strength boost. Look at it. 
strength, evasion, ether attack, luck. He needs more luck because his critical hit rate sucks ass. But, you know, there you go. It's it's beautiful. It's a thing of fucking beauty. Alright, now that we got that, let's get the fuck out of this place. <clears throat> Security level has been switched to A. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. Thank you for your commentary, lady. It really helps me in dead moments. <laughs> Seriously, it does help, so I do appreciate it. Oh, bitch. Uh, in any case, oh, we got a, a purchase plate over there. I wonder if they sell some new items. Let's find out, shall we? That bitch out of here. Move! Nice. When you're in my way, you got to move, or I'm gonna break you. Damn! Bitch! There you go. Oh, where the fuck are we? No enemies in here. Actually, keep this room in mind for later. We'll be coming back here in just a minute. I want to see what's... Oh, okay, never mind. I guess we're going now. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, cutscene. Area 13. That number. What is it, Xi'an? Cosmos, do you know where this door leads? If it is the same as 15 years ago, the special equipment transport elevator, which connects to the acute neurosis treatment facility, lies ahead. How does she know that? Hmm. I knew it. It connects to Mom's room. Do you want to go and rescue her? Hey, what's up? Something happened? She on? No, nothing. Let's go. You sure? Okay. Hmm. Yeah. I wonder what Shion says if we um if I have her leave at this point. Let me see. Hmm. Yeah. I thought I thought she would have said something um different right there, but oh well. In any case, um let me switch. I need Ziggy in. There you go, because we got more hard bitches coming up. And I need one of my main man. Let's see. Oh! Security level has been switched to A. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. <laughs> Out of my way! Because you're in my way, and I'm going to move your ass! Slow you down first, though. Now! Everyone is equipped with yellow rings, by the way, if I didn't mention it. So I recommend that you do the same. <laughs> yes, no! God, I love that move, man. Hmm. Now, which fucker should I penetrate? <laughs> You're the lucky man today. How fortunate. <laughs> Ooh, ow! Balls deep, bitch! <laughs> Damn. Okay, so they want to penetrate Shion now? Well, okay, well, if, uh, I guess this stands the reason I did penetrate one of their guys, so they have to penetrate one of my party members. It's only fair. However, uh, I'm not going to let you get it that easily. You're going to have to work for that shit. There you go. Yeah, it's not all freebies up in this bitch. Noise. And now, break yourself! Damn! Stay sharp. Fucking A, Ziggy! Shit! Nice, though. Nice. <laughs> when I mean break yourself, he literally breaks the shit out of those bitches. Ha! <laughs> Alright, just wanted to show that off. Alright, uh. According to past data, we can. Okay, thank you, lady. Rude. According to past data, we can head to the isolated research board where the vessels of Anima are located by using this elevator. There are no alternative paths to the research board from this area. Makes sense, I guess. In any case, this leads back to that area that we were at a little while ago. Is this door open? Oh, it does. Cool. Alright, do they got any new equipment? 
No, they do not. I guess I, guess I shouldn't have expected it, I, I suppose. Since we just started the chapter. And oh yeah, viewers, I mentioned earlier that the seven moons can inflict the crystallization status. So whenever you use the seven moons, because I had to revive Shion in one of those previous fights. Whenever you revive someone, they will have the crystallization status on them. So have somebody use an anti-crystal or that person use an anti-crystal to get rid of the crystallization status. Trust me, you don't want what happened to Momo in that Voyager fight to happen to one of your party members in random encounters. The fuck? So I can't even use the damn elevator. Wow, okay, so I guess I have to go the long way. As usual. Wow, what a shock. Hmm. You would think... We had Miyuki here fucking this up, but no, no. We can't blame her for everything. Yes, we will. New enemy here. Um, uh, Carnecos. Carnecos. Now, Carnecos is also an enemy that was in the first game. Uh, the second game, I mean. <laughs> in any case, 800 HP is weak to ice and lightning. Actually, wait a minute. He's strong against ice, but he's weak to light. So, there you go. Obviously. Now! Ha! You know what? Maybe I should have used the save point back there, because I kind of need more EP. That was dumb of me. No! And here I am telling you guys to fucking, um, save and save often. Yeah, I don't even take my own fucking advice. Oh, well! Balls deep. Ziggy, you get a small chance, small chance of executing swordfish from behind. So even if you do use backfish, well, I'll show you right now. He didn't do anything, but there is a chance that he can do something. Just wanted to let you know that, viewers, just in case you were curious what that move is. Ha! There you go. All right, so you're next, bitch. Ha! Running out of EP now, so I'm gonna have to finish your ass now. Ha! Goodbye! Okay. Hmm. Nice. Alright, let me let me get back to the save point real quick. The enemy's probably gonna respawn, I'm sure. Alright. There we go. There you go. Well, while we head on back, viewers, I'm gonna get me some hashtag coffee. There you go. I'm using my thermos today. The dude just let me walk right past him! Wow. Oh, oh. Hey, dude. Whoa! <laughs> Hello. Are you not going to attack me? Oh, well, I can attack you, though. Alright, viewers, I'm back. I got rid of the two guards. In any case. See what's in here. Uh, treasure chest. We get a great file ten. Nice. That's not exact. Uh, yeah, this is what this is actually what I wanted to get in here. We get ten swimsuits. Nice. All right. Let's see. It's gonna be odd kind of seeing Jen in a swimsuit because I'm so used to him wearing a kimono and some shit. <laughs> Let's see, this will lower his ether defense and vitality. But, as usual, um, luck stat up the ass and agility up. So, it's not bad, I guess. Plus, you get to see your favorite characters in their swimsuits. So, there you go. Alright, in any case, um, actually, let me bring Jen in because I want to see how he looks in his, um, his swimsuit. <laughs> Alright, now that we got that, let's continue on then. Ah, excuse me. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. Yes, lady, we know that. Oh my gosh, she's so annoying. Like, we know it's been cut off. You don't have to repeat it like 10,000 times. Because we knew. We always know. Ugh, got more enemies up in this bitch. What's in here? Whoa! 
I'm serious, viewers. They put these enemies in some weird ass fucking locations. Just to fuck with the player. In any case, we get D frame one for our ES. If we can even use them. I miss my Gundams. In any case. Oh, that's where that leads. Alright, um. Wait a minute, is he asleep? Wow, he is fucking asleep. <laughs> Dude is fucking asleep on the job! He reminds me of that one guy in red, blue, and yellow in Pokemon that's asleep in front of Sefco and stuff. And it's like... <sighs> stuff like that, just sleeping on the job. Wow. You guys will see what I mean when I eventually get to that point in um my Pokemon Yellow LP. Pew! Oh shit! Uh huh? What was that noise? All right, viewers, I'm back. The the item that was remaining in that room before that dude attacked me was just a Nano Repair M. Yay! <laughs> huh? What was that noise? Yeah, that woke you up, but the battles nearby in the same hallway did not wake you up, dude. Okay. Hmm. They must not pay their guards enough in this era. In any case, revive L. Noise. Luckily, you won't take that L if you get revived by this item. <laughs> no. Okay, that was that was lame. I am so sorry. In any case, the fuck are these? Well, whatever they are, they're getting blown the fuck up. Ew! Blow them to smithereens! Nice. Hmm. Why they put money in that, I have no idea. Oh my gosh, we have another puzzle. Wonderful. This one is a little annoying, but security level has been switched to A. We have to All go with them in um number formation. So bear with me, viewers, because I might go a slightly slow here. But if you need the comp if you need the uh, information, then uh yeah, pretty much. Um Okay, we have to hit D1. D1 should be Security level this has been switched to A. I think. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. Yeah, it has to be this one. Ha! Okay, we hit D1. Next we need to hit D3. Alright. Now we have to hit A3. Which should be in the same row. This should be A3 right here. Alright. Nice. Alright, now we gotta hit A5. All access to standby hangar and storage is cut off. I oh god. I hope I hit the right one. <laughs> I probably failed. Uh, let's see. Now we gotta hit C5. Which I assume is this one. Then there's E5. Uh, just nothing over here! Okay, okay, I really fucked that up then. Okay, never mind! Ay, ay, ay. I think I was looking at my notes the wrong way. <laughs> this is why you need to have glasses on when you're looking at notes. Alright, so reposition them. Damn it. Security level has Jeez, been switched man. To A. We're laid out in a 5x5 block formation, numbering them in horizontally from A to E. Oh my gosh, this is not fair! Alright, so let's try this again. Hmm. I assume one starts at the top and five ends at the bottom. Alright, so if that is the case, we have to hit D1. So let's try this It's D1. Now we hit D3. Uh, D3 should be this one. I hope. <laughs> see, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Actually, that's four. Okay, never mind then. Security it's this one. Alright, All that's D3. Now we gotta off. hit A3. Let's see. One, one, 
two, three. This one. All right, now we have to hit a five. One, two, three, four, five. So this one right here. Next we have to hit C5. So A, B, C. So I guess it would be this one now. All right, next we have to hit E5, which is all the way over here. And with that, did that solve the issue? I think it did. Woohoo! I did it! Nice! Good job! Good job! You're so clever. <laughs> if you do that, you get 50, 50k right there. So if you needed the money, there you go. In any case, we hope we get D nullify guard for our ES. Yay. Now we can continue. <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, let's move on then. Uh, cutscene. Hmm? What's that? Hmm? I don't care about you obsessing over that doll of your daughter. Sellers of Miss Rahi. But I can't have you forgetting the real objective. Yeah, don't forget that. While I get some hashtag off that thing. The operation has already begun. You and Winnicott formulated it. I don't see why you need me. I'm going to take over the management of this experiment. If you've lost your nerves. Do as you wish. It's no longer my concern. Mm. Is that Joachim, Miss Rahi? Daddy. Wow. Momo! Oh. What is she doing? Wait a minute. This isn't a place for children. Wow, man. Uh, um, I'm sorry. I got lost. He doesn't know it, but he's talking to the daughter that he's about to create. To model after his deceased daughter, Sakura. Wow, man. This is, this is like haunting almost. <laughs> You're not very good at lying, young lady. <laughs> no, we're just sneaking into the place. Do you think you could give me a hand? Huh? Oh, okay. This is cute, though. Oh. What kind of research are you doing, Professor? Hmm? Actually, I'm making a realian like you. What? Uh, I'm not a... Yes, you are. You don't have to hide it. I can tell. <laughs> I lost my daughter to illness. I thought that if I could retrieve her consciousness, I might be able to return her to life. Ah, so that's the... I think that's the reason why he wanted to make Momo. To revive. So I studied the UMN, the Zohar, and Udu for that purpose. To revive his deceased daughter, Sakura. Reviving the consciousness of the dead? Yes. The Unis Mundus network, just as its name implies, is a collective subconscious that's existed since the moment the universe was born. It's a fundamental part of nature. Through my research of the Zohar, I discovered the existence of what appears to be human consciousness within the UMN. Consciousnesses are born from the UMN. If I could discover that process, I could fulfill my wish. Wow. But my daughter's consciousness has disappeared. The new consciousness, which is growing, is not hers. Oh. Wow. He doesn't even know that he's talking to the very reality and that he is creating right now. That is so scary. I feel so bad for Momo, man. 
but I think that's all right. Uh. This child will surely become the hope of all realians. That hope may become a way to stop the looming threat of the expansion of the universe. Our second daughter. I'm sure Sakura would have wanted that. Mm. Her name was Sakura? Yes. My wife and I came up with the name together. She was a cute child just like you. This world must continue to exist for you and others. I must stop them. How? Who? Oh, I'm sorry for making you listen to the ramblings of an old man. Now go. I'm sure there are people worried about you. This is where Mo well, Momo always kind of knew this, but her father was not a lunatic, as some would say, as we were let's believe in the first game and everything like that. No, no. And Momo can see it here. Finally being able to speak with her father. It's, it, it's beautiful, but it's sad at the same time. At least she got to speak with him. So I'm sure that gave her comfort. Momo, are you okay? I talked with Daddy. He called me his second daughter. He said he's going to protect the world for us. I... I... Momo. Oh. Yeah, I'm happy for you, Momo. <laughs> there is definitely a fan fiction Security of Momo and Junior somewhere. <laughs> They've had some kind of connection since since the first game. I mean, obviously, if you played the second game, you already know that um, Junior our, Junior knew Yuli and her daughter Sakura back in the day and stuff like that. Sakura had asked Junior to protect her little sister, a.k.a. Momo, who was about to be born and stuff like that. So, yeah, ever since then, but Junior didn't know where Momo was until they finally met in the first game. So, ever since then, Junior has always been looking out for her. So, you know, to fulfill the promise he made to Sakura. So, it's cute! Alright, viewers, I'm back. A little further. Whoa! Kevin and Sue. <gasps> That's. Kevin and Dad? they up to? Huh. What is going on here? Xion? Where are you going? What's this? Looks like his private room. Xion! It's a list of the test subjects. So, he really was involved with Yutik. You kind of already knew this already. Xion, this name. Yes, it's my mother's name. She was one of the victims of the experiments performed here. Damn. She was put here by the hands of the ones she trusted. No, below that. Below? Hmm? Shion Uzuki? The fuck? Why is Shion's name in this list? What? Why is my name here? I exactly my question. Jin, what does this mean? You know something, don't you? Spill the beans! Uh. No, you're the same as Dad. Whoa, 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 okay. I wouldn't go that far, Shion. You knew everything, and still you let them do that to Mom. No, Xion, it's not like that. Then what is it? If you haven't done anything wrong, then explain it to me. Xion. Damn. Whoa! Uh, <gasps> are those 27 series Asheras? What? That's... 
can't be. Yeah, we fought them in the first game. Doing that thing in Cosmosis Encephalon. Hmm. Are those combat realians? Hell no! Nah. Doubt about it. Or those are the prototype combat realians the UTIC organization used during the Milshan conflict. Wow. Those are the realians that killed Mom. Why are they here? I remember. Yeah, we saw that in the first game, that cutscene. Wow, man. Those things. Why? I'd imagine they were developed here. No shit. These things are some scary fuckers, man. No. It can't be. Kevin killed Mom? Your boyfriend killed your mother? Uh, oh, shit. Um. Uh. Oh. There's no way that can be true. Yeah, there's no way that could be true. There's no way my name could be in this list. Jen must know something. It's your fault. Yeah, keep blaming everyone for your problems. But yeah, I know this is serious. Xion. Xion. Chill out, girl. Relax. Are you all right? We could cancel this operation. I'm fine. I just got a little worked up. Ugh. When the conflict starts, this place will be part of the battlefield. It'll be too late then. If we miss this chance, it'll be impossible to get the vessels of Anima. Shion. Ooh. Man. She, she went through some shit. <laughs> In any case, before we continue on, I want to go to the area that, you know, I had skipped. Now. Bitches. Now this is where I was before that um that cutscene clip. Ha! Mr. Destroy knows to get a revive M. Noise. But yeah, so Shen must know something about what happened back then. It makes me wonder why he's not telling Shion about it. Weird. There must be a reason for this. I guess I guess we will find out. Wait, wait, we're back here again! Huh. Weren't we just here? Well, we actually, well, we went the other way, but... Security level huh. Switched like a, a loop around. All access wow. To standby hangar and the door to ah, excuse me. Ah, here we go. Hmm. Security level has been switched Oh, yeah, the elevator! Does it work? Unable to confirm security level B access privileges. Bitch. I still can't wait a minute. Oh right, I missed it. Viewers, I'll be right back. Our right, viewers are back. I had completely missed this. Over here we get. Yeah, we get the security level B card. How how the fuck did I miss that? It was glowing! Huh? Security level has been switched to A. All access to Why did it look like that there for a second? Hmm, weird. In any case, <sighs> there's a part I want to get to. I hope I can get to that now. Security level has been switched to A. All access to standby hangar and storage. May or may not have time for it today. Well, viewers, we got the security level B card. Further mysteries. A lot of shit. What the fuck is going down here? Find out next time. You guys enjoy it, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for Gimme Biz for me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment. Duh. Till next time, dudes and dudettes, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Security Smile you later.